Blockswitch is a brand that's about over 100 years old. In about 1960, they got invited into intermodal transport, which is making shipping containers. And that bit was to raise all the patents for the locks, the hinges, and all the ancillary items for what we know as shipping containers. We started to get into trucks and trailers. And now we're supplying markets like Offshore Oil, where they adapt shipping containers. We still do trucks and trailers. People want 3D models, they want to have, if they come up with something innovative and they say, well, can we change it slightly? You need to adapt. We were stuck with 2D drawings and basic AutoCAD. And I came across SolidWorks and we signed just there and then and we bought our first license and we've never looked back. Yeah, I can't imagine designing some of the products that we've got, the complex sort of forged, stamped sort of geometry, if you didn't use SolidWorks. You know, trying to do something in 2D, it'd be a nightmare, it would take well, 20 times as long. We have a stamping division and we have a plastic injection moulding uh, division. Um, What's neat about SolidWorks is that you can design the product and then you can start thinking about how you're going to manufacture it. We can go into solid plastics and uh, sheet metal. Now, in as much as that, we're able to develop our tooling very quickly. Here we can go straight to laser cutting and then we can just go to folding. Now, to do that, we need to be able to fold metal on the CAD system and SolidWorks gives us that. A lot of my time is spent using SOLIDWORKS for creating designs, you know, creating drawings. And a lot of my time latterly has been creating sort of rendered images for use in catalogues, use in our online shop, use in any sort of presentation and sort of marketing material we've got. SOLIDWORKS Composer you know, has been a big part of our, our recent sort of catalogue that we published you know, earlier on in the year. It's a big part of uh, our online shop, the images created in there you know, were created from Composer. You know, the renders obviously were coming from SOLIDWORKS Photo View 360 and visualise as well. We can use those designs on our internet, we can pre-launch the product before we've made it, and for us, it gives us the strength of engineering that we don't have to carry a, a big team. So downstairs in a very old wooden drawer is a lot of 2D drawings, and there are some good products in there, security products, products that probably went out of vogue that we can bring back. We've got to find a way to draw them, develop them, prototype them, test them, and all of that can be done very easily on SolidWorks. You know, our static testing, load testing, it can all be done very quickly. Simulation Express, you know, we've used quite a bit and, uh, you know, going forward, we're keen to investigate, you know, SolidWorks simulation for assemblies. We do a lot of testing on products, you know, load testing, you know, just simple sort of tests. But again, to do that physically, you know, on a, on a new product you're designing takes time, costs money. Some of the sort of features like collision detection, for example, you know, there's nothing like, you know, testing it and testing it and testing it and testing it on screen and, and knowing, having the confidence to go and produce it without embarrassing yourself. The 3D printer goes at the rate it does, but the, the geometry and then you know, the interface of the 3D printer is invaluable. We can take a product that we think that's going to sell, we can draw it, we can 3D print it, we can show it to our customers, we can ascertain at that point whether the market's there for us, we can adapt it what the customer needs very quickly and we can go to market very quickly indeed. So that time circle is almost a week. Historically, it might have been three months. Well, to be honest, I think they've got an excellent relationship with CAD Tech. You know, I find them extremely helpful. I have done since day one. You know, certainly Mike invested in the extra sort of license of software when I joined the company. Probably got fed up with me <laughs> in the head office. I think I may have been on the phone probably daily, you know, until my sort of knowledge of SolidWorks and then Composer and the Visualize and all those other bits of software was, was topped up with training courses. Second to none, I think, to be honest. Pretty much instantaneous. If you've got a problem, you phone them up, there's somebody available, you can have it nailed within 10, 20 minutes. There are some great characters at CAD Tech. Um, you can phone all of them up. They all know your name. Most of them know your products now. So they've all had the uh, sads and glads of trying to develop from a 2D drawing to a 3D model. It's a great team. And I think uniquely CAD tech have that ability to help customers and we're so pleased to work with it.
we could stand there and with our old designs, our old systems, and just sit there and stag stagnate, or we can get on board, use SolidWorks, accelerate, you know, not only use it for prototyping, design, approval, customer interaction, publicity, the tools are all there, we've got a one-stop shop.